Hello everyone, welcome to another ChatGPT4 video. Today I will show you how you can potentially use ChatGPT4 for meal planning and how you can use plugins from ChatGPT uh, to actually do this. So actually GPT4 announced or OpenAI actually announced that they will be using plugins uh, you know, to implement in ChatGPT. Now these plugins are not yet available, but it, they will be available soon. So actually this tutorial will be valid after they release all these plugins. Now, if you want to go and join the plugin waitlist, you can join the plugin waitlist and you will obviously need to go and fill out all of this in order to get started. Now, before that, obviously I wanted to show you how to do meal planning with a simple example of ChatGPT plugins. As you can see, this is the video. So let's play the video and let me show you how. Today I'm going to show you how you So as you can see, we have model, which is plugins, and then we have plugins, and then we can select plugins from that drop down, right? So this will be uh, soon available for everyone, as you can see. You can use ChatGPT to do some simple meal planning. First, let's head to the plugin store to install the necessary plugins. So basically, he's going to a plugin store and he will install necessary plugins, right? Which is Wolfram Alpha, right? And a few other plugins as well, right? Next, let's ask ChatGPT for a restaurant recommendation. As you can see, it will give a restaurant recommendation. So let's let's see that. On Saturday, a recipe for Sunday, the total calorie count, and to order the ingredients on Instacart. So as you can see, it used OpenTable, the plugin, right? So you can see it right here. First, it's using OpenTable to find me a great restaurant for Saturday. For Sunday, it's finding me a simple recipe and it's asking Wolfram Alpha to calculate the calories. 862, great. So as you can see, it, ga it gave him basically the restaurant. It gave him the you know ingredients and it also gave him calories that he can see. So this is basically a way how you will be able to use GPT-4 for meal planning, right? Now let's make the shopping list. And as you can see, he also used Instacart plugin, which basically made him a shopping list, right? For chickpea salad, which was basically a salad that, you know, ChatGPT-4 with plugins gave him. So this is basically what, only one way how you will be able to use GPT-4 for meal planning. Now this is still in beta, right? This is still in testing, so it's not available for everyone. So obviously if you want to join the plugins waitlist, the link is down below. And yeah, obviously comment down below your opinions about this and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.